This is how to play Anarchy in the UK by the Sex Pistols and it's an open G tuning. G, D, G, and B if you've got it, but you don't need it. Three or four string. So it's all power chords, um, starting off at the 5th fret on the D string and 7th fret on the high G string. There's two ways you can do this riff. So uh, I'll put some distortion on actually, to make it sound a bit better. So that's the 5th and the 7th. 5th on D, 7th on the high G. Down to the third on the D string and the fifth on the G string. Then the second and the fourth. Then open D and second fret on the high G string. And then down to the fifth fret on the low G string and the D string together. So goes like this. You sort of chug that in if you can palm mute it with the palm of your right hand. Or your left if you're lefty. The alternative way to play that is all on the low G and the D string. You start off at the 12th fret. So it'd be 12, then 10, then 9, then 7, then 5 in this pattern. Whichever way you're comfortable with, there's exactly the same notes. Um, so I play it on the the D and high G strings, but both sound fine. Then the next part you can play two ways again, so it stays on the 5th fret of the low G and the D string. This is when the singing comes in. Then it's the power chord at the 3rd fret of D and 5th of G, then 2nd of D and 4th of G. So that just repeats over and over. on the fifth for that last one so alternatively again you would start at the fifth and then you've got to the tenth then the ninth on the low G and the D string together so to the chorus I want to be an anarchist which is the same as the first part then, then open low G and D string just to finish that part off and then it goes back to 
um, the second riff. So I'll play that again slowly. To it is um, underneath the solo, which um, I'm not going to get into, and it's not that complicated, but um, this is just about the rhythm of the song. So it would be up at the 7th fret on the low G and D string up to the 9th. string and 2nd fret on the high G and then up to 2nd fret on the D and 4th fret on the high G. There's a sort of little shuffle bit, which is again 7th fret on low G and D up to, and then you do a hammer on, so you stay on the, on the 7th, and then you hammer on to the 9th fret of the D string with your 3rd finger, do that twice, and then do pinky on the 10th. Back to the seven, eight, ninth. Um, you can keep coming off the D string, so you would sort of go. And then finish off with a ten, nine again. So, like this. Slowly. I shall speed it up. Cheers.